Welcome back. In this video, I'm going to show you how to check and interpret candidate results. Once you've logged into your DevSkiller account, you will arrive on the candidates dashboard. In this example, you see three candidates with three different statuses. John Smith, who has been marked accepted, John Smith, who has been marked rejected, and John Smith, who has been marked waiting for decision. The status navigation at the top of your screen helps you to keep track of all the candidates in your pipeline. You can view the number of candidates that are in a given stage, including waiting for answers, in evaluation, waiting for decision, accepted, rejected, expired, and cancelled or error. Select on a single candidate for a more detailed view. Here, you have all the necessary information about the candidate, actions, and timeline of the recruitment process to date. The skills summary highlights the candidate's proficiency in tested skills. The scores that you see here are related to a given question or task that has been tagged with that particular skill. Click on the View Share Report button for a detailed report of the candidate's results, including answer summary and individual section overview. On the right-hand control panel, you can toggle report preferences to drill down on individual sections. The share report button allows you to share the candidate's results with your colleagues with a unique link. Thank you for taking time to watch these instructional videos. We wish you all the best on your trial, and if you need support at any time, please don't hesitate to contact our support by clicking on the help button or starting a chat by clicking on the button at the bottom right of your screen.